My guess is if you clicked on this video, you've also been getting these extremely low fastest lap times in F122. This bug has been plaguing my races for the past couple of weeks, but I finally found a way to get rid of the bug and get the normal fastest lap time back again. I feel like it has something to do with using the broadcast formation lap option. If you use that setting, you can see in the top right corner that there's already a lap time on screen and the race starts not at zero but at that lap time. And if we skip forward to the end of the second sector, you can see in the top right that the lap time starts over again. I have a sector time of 2.2 seconds which doesn't make any sense whatsoever. And now it started counting from zero again at the start of the third sector. And this is exactly what messes up the fastest lap times. If we skip ahead to the end of the lap, you can see right here that Leclerc just put in a lap time of 37.7 seconds. Which is way lower than a lap time that anybody will ever do for the rest of this race. So until Codemasters patch this, we need to fix this. And we can. So what do you do? After you've completed the broadcast formation lap, pause the game, do restart session and start your race from there. Right now there's still some weird sector time in the top right corner but it will go down to zero once the race starts and there you go. It starts counting the way it should and if we skip ahead to the end of the lap you'll be able to see that the lap time that's recorded by Leclerc who's in front is now 141.9 regular lap time and the bug is gone. So this should hopefully fix the issue for you guys as well. Let me know if this worked for you or not. In the end I'm hoping Codemasters will patch this one soon. But until that time you can use this fix. I hope this was a useful video for you guys. Leave a thumbs up if it was. And I'll be back tomorrow with a new My Team Career Mode video. So I'll see you in the next one guys.